Hey everyone. So it's been a while. I wanted to, first of all, Alora is sleeping right now, taking her nap. I don't want to talk too loud because she is sick. She has a slight cold because of the crazy weather going on here in North Carolina. But I figured I'd sit down and give you guys kind of like a little life update. Um, let you know how I've been, how I'm doing currently, and you know, I guess what you can expect from here on out. So first of all, I missed you guys a whole lot. I just needed the break very badly. Oh, also, um, I don't have my studio lights on. I figured I'd just sit down old school style, literally just turn on my camera. Um, I'm in natural light, so that's what's going on. If it looks a little, I don't know, off, it's because I'm in front of natural light and you know, I don't have the whole production going on right now. Yeah, I, I just needed the break. And to be quite honest, I'm still not all the way motivated to come back to YouTube yet. But you know, I figured a month is long enough. So here I am, hope you guys miss me. <laughs> so I am excited because I'm gonna be showing you guys my new makeup, quick makeup routine. And I know I just did an everyday makeup look that you know, takes 10 or so minutes. I have a new product that you guys are probably going to fall in love with as much as I'm in love with it and I cannot wait to tell you about it because it makes my life so much easier. All right girl we are doing powder foundation today and ugh, I have been loving my new makeup routine and it's like super simple. Um, you know I've just kind of been into that natural um, not really a no makeup makeup look, but definitely not like a full face beat, just, you know, your face but better type of thing, you know? So what I'm gonna do first, I'm just gonna spot conceal a little bit because although my skin is getting so much better and I do plan on doing a skincare routine for you guys, showing you what I've been doing and how I've been able to basically be breakout free since last year really. A lot of you have been asking over on Instagram to do like an updated skincare routine so I'm definitely gonna do that really really soon but I'm just spot concealing with my Too Faced Born This Way concealer and I did get this concealer um, for my skin tone, like my actual skin tone to spot conceal. And this is in the shade Toffee. And I'm just gonna take a fluffy blending brush and literally just, you know, kind of blend that out. I'm just really going around the edges, honestly. And I am so happy, you guys, that my dark marks are starting to lighten up. And, you know, I don't really break out all that often anymore. Maybe around that time of the month, I'll have a few little breakouts, but for the most part, your girl is acne free. And I think that has a lot to do with just me, you know, taking better care of myself, um, making sure that I take my vitamins. Um, I've been taking some really high quality sea moss, and so things are just getting a lot better around here. I'm actually gonna put like a dab of that concealer and that was probably too much on my eyelid. So I've been good, you guys. I, like I said, I needed this break very, very badly. And I was watching Jackie Ina's video a while ago and she was even saying, you know, she had been away from YouTube for a while now and I noticed that she wasn't uploading and I was like what in, what in the world is going on with all of my favorite creators like nobody is really uploading like that anymore and it's because I just feel like creatives and she said this in her video we get burnt out so quickly especially with me you know being a wife and a mom to a toddler it's like girl I need a break. So that looks really good. And that literally took like two seconds. Okay, so 
let's talk about this product that I have been obsessed with. So really quickly before I rant and rave about how fabulous this product is, I wanted to thank our partners at Wonder2 for partnering with us on this video. And I'm here to tell you guys about their Go Beyond Foundation. Had to move my mirror out of the way. Now look, this is a powder foundation. Now, I think my favorite thing about this foundation, aside from like, you know, the benefits, it comes in only five shades, you guys. So it is so easy to choose your perfect foundation shade. And you know, with the panoramic, I don't wanna say the real word, but you know, with everything going on in the world, it's kind of hard to like go out and choose your foundation shade, you know? So Wonder 2 has made it so easy for all of us, um, you know, by creating just five shades of this foundation. So it is so easy and convenient to choose your perfect shade. Now I have the shade medium and it says that it's in the deep range but before I put on my powder foundation I'm just gonna go ahead and conceal underneath my eyes a little bit just a little bit so that I can wake up cuz girl like I said Allura is sick right now and so when I went to go feed her last night she wasn't breathing that well and so of course me being a first-time mom I started panicking and you know we were trying to figure out what to do because we didn't have any she's never been sick before um and she'll be 16 months in a few weeks and so you know i don't have any you know like infant cough medicine or anything like that and all of the stores around here are closed so it's not like Elliot could run to the store really quickly and get her something. So I had to improvise. Um, and you know, that had us up. And so I am like super duper tired right now, but you know, that's a part of the mom life. Okay, when I tell you guys I am obsessed with this new kind of like routine that I have going on, it's literally just like, oh, it's so dangerous. I have not been really caring for, I won't say I don't like it anymore, but I just have not been caring for, you know, like liquid foundation and then putting the concealer on top. I just, I like my skin, okay? The fact that my skin is getting better I'm trying to be on your skin, but better, literally. But the thing is, before you put on any type of like powder foundation, you have to make sure that you get all of your liquids out of the way first. You know, put your liquids on underneath the powder foundation because if not, it's gonna be a hot mess. But girl, this is my base. Look at that. All right, so back to this foundation. Another reason why I love this foundation so much is because it's complexion enhancing, meaning it literally just, and this is what you do. You just take the brush, the kabuki brush that comes with it. Well, I'm not sure if the kabuki brush actually comes with the foundation or if you have to buy the kabuki brush separate, separately, but I absolutely love this brush that comes with it and you guys do you see like literally it blurs out everything like oh my god why the heck would I even ever wear powder or uh, liquid foundation anymore seriously you just take it and you put it on all over and like I said it comes in five shades so it's so easy to choose your perfect shade and look it's perfect Another thing that I really, really love about this foundation is the fact that it's lightweight, which is kind of why I'm like over liquid foundations. I hate the feeling of having something on my face and that something meaning foundation. And so if I can get a convenient foundation that, you know, doesn't really feel like anything, girl, I am winning, okay? It doesn't settle into like your fine lines or like wrinkles. So it's really good for every 
single age range. This is literally giving your skin but better. And it looks like I'm piling it on, but I'm not. I'm just trying to set kind of like the concealer that I just put on. And another great thing about this foundation that I just absolutely love, especially if I'm like going out somewhere, you know, like to the grocery store or if we're having family day or something like that, this is water and transfer resistant. So, you know, if you have you know, leaky eyes like me, my allergies here in North Carolina have had me on my deathbed. Oh my God. And then also, of course, hopefully everybody is wearing their mask. I definitely am. And so anytime I go out and I have my mask on, if I have this foundation on girl, it ain't, it's not gonna transpire. So you don't have to worry about, you know, your makeup getting messed up or anything like that. Look at how flawless my face looks. I don't have on any liquid foundation. And that is literally it for my base, you guys. I'm just gonna throw on some blush, um, you know, probably put a little bronzer on my um, in my crease area, do a lip and call it a day. So as you can see, it like evened out my skin so well. I love the fact that as soon as you put it on, especially with this brush, this brush is the bomb. You can literally see it blurring out your imperfections. <laughs> it's so good. Now this is the type of foundation that makes me feel, and it's not necessarily the foundation, it's just the fact that it's so easy, convenient, it gives me everything I need in a foundation without the bad stuff. It doesn't have any talk. I don't know if I said that already, but it doesn't have any talk. It's vegan, it's cruelty free if you care about that stuff. So normally it's really hard for me to keep makeup on throughout the day. Like as soon as I shoot or you know have to work, if I have a meeting or whatever, I take my makeup off so quick just because I just hate the feeling of having makeup on like I literally hate it but anytime I wear this I don't have that feeling it's incredible I absolutely love this foundation so if you're interested in the go beyond powder foundation I will have a link and a coupon code for you in the description box so you can use the code Larissa 10 and I believe you'll receive 10% off of your order. So this is all I'm doing. I'm just taking my NARS bronzer and applying into my crease and then I'm taking it up into kind of like my um, the start of my brow and then I'm gonna contour my nose really quickly. Let me move my mirror over here. So I've been doing much better, you guys. Um, I feel like God has just been really healing a lot of the parts of myself that I didn't recognize needed healing. And he's been doing that. And I just told Elliot the other day, or actually the other night, I said, wow, the Lord is really using the people around me I mean, obviously he's using other things too, but he's using my husband, he's using my daughter, he's using my friends. My friends are a huge part of my healing process. And I feel like, you know, when I told him that I would cooperate with him in this process, um, I wasn't really expecting him to do it the non-traditional route. And it's just been, amazing not amazing necessarily in a good way and I don't want to sound pessimistic saying that but I mean it's been amazing just seeing him um, do things in me and through me that he wouldn't normally do outside of my cooperation and I feel like that speaks to my maturity as a Christian, I don't know. I don't know if this is making any kind of sense, but it's been kind of like a really cool process to witness if that makes any sense. Sorry, I've been drinking a ton of water lately. So yeah, I've been in a really good place. I feel like 
And I'm just using this bronzer kind of to warm up the perimeter of my face. I feel like I definitely needed this break from YouTube. Now I've been working on a lot of other things um, outside of YouTube. I haven't really been that active on Instagram and that's because I am in the process of launching something that I've been working on for almost two years now. And so I'm trying to get that together and I thought we were going to launch at the end of this month, but because we've been so busy, you know, with other things that we have going on, other uh, business ventures, and then Laura is teething right now. She has a lot of teeth that are cutting, like right at her gum line. So that's been a, a doozy to say the least. All right, so I am going to apply some blush with, this is such a good brush, you guys. I'm actually gonna use this brush, the Kabuki brush from Wonder, um, to apply my blush. And this is just because it just distributes it so evenly. Uh, oh, let me tell you guys about the blush that I'm using. I keep moving my mirror back and forth because I mean, I just feel like the lighting keeps changing and that's because again, I'm in front of my huge windows in my office and I'm just using um, the back of my beauty blender, the excess product that I use to blend out, you know, my under eyes and stuff just to clean up that um, bronzer line. So yeah, Allura has been, ugh, She's been being a toddler, okay? By the way, I'm using this beautiful um, Trio Face Palette by Sephora. I went in the other day and I saw this and was like, oh my gosh, yes. It comes with like a blush and I think two highlighters. Um, this one is the Empower Palette. It is just absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna use this gold shade, which is kind of why I got it. The gold shade and the blush shade. And I'm just gonna apply just a little bit of highlighter. I meant to put on my liquid highlighter underneath all of this powder, but um, yeah, I typically use a liquid highlighter to just throw on underneath this um, Go Beyond foundation. Yes, girl, it's giving springtime glow, which is what I absolutely love. Like this is so up my alley these days. Uh, I'm even going to take a little bit of that gold and dust it on top of my eyelid just a little bit. Okay, so in addition to the Go Beyond foundation as well as the Kabuki brush, Wonder 2 sent over some liners and mascara. I think, I feel like I've talked about this mascara on my channel before. I can't remember, but... Now I have like three tubes of these. One they sent over in a, I think a PR something a while ago. And then I loved the mascara so much that I ended up buying it with my own money. And they sent over a new one. So I have their Wonder Extensions Lash Extension and Curl Mascara. Such a fabulous mascara, you guys. And then they also sent over the Super Stay Liner. And I'm going to put this in my waterline really quickly. This is in the shade Essential Brown. Now, normally I don't do... Hold on. Normally I don't do a brown eyeliner, but it's been giving. It's literally perfect for every day. Like, it's not as stark as a black eyeliner. So after the liner, I'm just gonna quickly apply some of the last lash extension mascara. Can you guys see? Like, I'm gonna show you the before and after. Hold on, let me switch my mirror again. I'm trying to hurry up because I have to cook um, and then I have to do a lot of planning and scheduling for this week's work week. And so that's why I didn't, you know, feel like bringing out my studio lights and doing the whole fancy setup. Um, and then, oh, I want to show you guys my um, closet. Oh, let me show you the before and after. Look at that. Mascara, no mascara. This is so freaking good. Like literally one of the best mascaras I've used. And that says a lot because... I normally, like, I literally never order mascara online. 
I just use what's sent to me in PR or something from the drugstore. But girl, this is so good. I had to buy it offline, okay? I'm gonna put a little bit on my lower lashes. I am absolutely in love with what I have going on today, makeup wise. Like, it's literally a pick me up. And I can go all day with this face. And that's because. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything. Now, when they say this foundation is lightweight, they literally mean it's lightweight because even with me, like if I pile it on accidentally one day, it doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything at all. All right, girl, that's basically it. I'm actually gonna use this oil infused lip tint by NARS because it's sitting in front of me, but I've been loving these lip tints lately. So this one is in the shade Reef. And I actually talked about this other shade, Laguna. Look how gorgeous this is. I talked about this over on Instagram the other day and I had so many people asking for the link. Um, so yeah, they're really good. I'm not even gonna put on a um, lip liner today. I'm just gonna put on a little gloss and that's it, girl. Look at me. Now this is what I've been doing for like meetings and um, my quick beat if I don't want to wear any liquid foundation and I have not been wearing liquid foundation for a while. I think I wore liquid foundation maybe once last week um, in a time span of like three weeks. It's been a while. All right, girl, so that is my face. I am loving how healthy and just vibrant I look oh, I love it I wanted to show y'all my face close up in the natural light let me actually turn this ISO down to the lowest setting which is 100 actually that's too low look at this foundation you guys I am absolutely obsessed All right, now I'm not sure why I have the urge to show y'all my closet because, I, I mean, I promise it's literally nothing fabulous, but I did get rid of, rid of a lot of clothes and shoes to make way for all of my spring clothes. And um, all of my spring clothes aren't even hung up yet because... I don't have any more hangers and I did get these hangers from Amazon. I will have them linked down below in the description box. I also got this fabulous shoe rack from Amazon as well and it holds a ton of shoes. It came in a set of two but um yeah I absolutely love this shoe rack so I'm just really proud of this closet because it took me quite some time to like organize everything and back there or down there rather I just have a bag of um, clothes that I'm going to give away to either women's shelter or Goodwill or something like that and then also I have these two huge bags of makeup and skincare that I'm going to give away to the women's shelter as well. So yeah, y'all, that's what I've been doing. I've been doing a ton of cleaning, like spring cleaning. Today is the second day of spring. So, um, you know, we've just been in, I have just been in the spring cleaning mood. And then um, we also got our balcony furniture in that's outside right now, but I don't want to like show you guys what it looks like right now because still have a, a quite a few things to get for the balcony area it, it is small but you know I want it to be an oasis out there I have been good and I hope that you guys have been good too um my marriage is I feel like it's never been better and um that's probably because I've just been doing a lot of soul work and um, Ellie's been going to the gym, so the brother is fine. Okay, he was just cleaning up with his shirt off yesterday, and I was like, oof. Y'all know how that night ended. Um, Alora is good. Everybody's doing good. So I feel like this break from YouTube has definitely helped me mentally a ton. Like, I've been able to prioritize um, and just focus on 
the things that I've been needed to needing to focus on. Sorry, let me get some water. Oh, also, obviously you wouldn't know this unless you follow me on Instagram, but if you are interested in becoming an influencer like if you're a current or an aspiring influencer and you want to learn how to level up how to start how to begin what to do how to do it um head over to my facebook group called the influencer corner and i wanted to do something for the current and aspiring influencers who have Jesus behind their name. You know what I mean? There are a lot of people out here showing people how to, you know, break into this influencer space, um, you know, to make money and to grow their following and all of that. But um, they're not necessarily teaching you how to do it from a godly standpoint and perspective, um, especially in these times, you know, new age and all the manifest stuff, don't get me started. And so I felt like the Lord was leading me to create kind of this uh, space and um, corner, if you will, for me to pour out everything that I know about influencing um, and, you know, just making money from being online and working with brands, my dream brands, making more money than I can literally ever imagine. I could literally ever imagine. And it's been fun. I created a whole, almost like a free course for my influencers in the group. So if you're interested, I will have the link down below in the description box. Um, you do have to be on Facebook, unfortunately, but um, we're working on something, okay? So stay tuned. And it's a really good group. We all support and uplift each other and um, I feel like I give a ton of value because I've been doing this for a long time now. So yeah, I will have everything in the description box. Thank you guys for hanging out with me today. I really did miss y'all. I miss y'all. Okay. So, uh, let the content resume. Please make sure you check the description box for, again, the link to all of the Wonder 2 products especially the go beyond foundation i absolutely love like i haven't been this obsessed with a foundation in a very long time and it's a powder foundation that matches my skin perfectly it's so good you guys so i am gonna wake actually no i'm gonna let her sleep a little bit but i'm gonna go in there and check on my husband make sure he's doing well i guess and then i'm gonna cook dinner um, and then, you know, we're going to have family time and have a good rest of the day. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, comment down below and let me know what content you want to see next. Um, I'll definitely be doing my updated skincare routine. I haven't done a skincare routine in I don't know how long, y'all. Okay, so it's going to be really, really good. I'm going to show you the exact products that I've been using to get my face so clear. I have a little, like burn right here i don't even want to talk about it <laughs> but other than that you know life is good god is good and jesus is still king so i will talk to you guys later Mwah. bye